Yeah, and the problem is, uh, like we've seen the past couple of days, we've got way too much all of a sudden. It's been raining down uh, south of town over the past couple of hours. Already picked up about two, three inches of rain out there by the airport. As you can see, maybe the uh, damp spot on the roads. We haven't had a lot of rain here in town, but look down to the south from uh, Atascosa County and even portions of Live Oak County back out to the west. Very heavy showers and thunderstorms down there. As a matter of fact, that green box, which was just issued, that is a flood warning, flash flood warning for portions of Zavala as well as Dimmick County up until 715. Again, already seen about two, three inches of rain. Can probably see another uh, inch to maybe three inches of rain in some of those spots. These storms aren't moving all that quickly. They are kind of sliding off to the east somewhat. And then a little bit further to the north, we do have flood advisories. Flood advisory all the way from uh, the extreme western edge of Wilson County back through Atascosa, Frio, Zavala, Dimmit counties. This is up until 630. And the same thing for portions of Medina as well as going back into uh, Uvalde. County. We do still have a few of those showers around there in and around town. We don't really have much rain. A couple of uh, well, maybe up there by Canyon Lake, a few of those uh, showers. We're going to start to see. We'll see this rain this morning. Then things are going to start to kind of ease up a little bit and then pick back up later on this afternoon. Mold, as you would expect, is extremely high at 12,600. And uh, grab a rain jacket, keep your umbrella handy. We've been getting some good use out of it the past couple of days, and that's going to continue to be the situation today. 77 degrees, showers and a few storms, especially down to the south. And then later on this afternoon, 90 high temperatures, scattered showers and a few storms. Winds a little bit breezy at times. Still some rain chances the next couple of days. We'll talk about that and take a look ahead to the weekend in just a couple of minutes. Steph, Mark.